What's up to the gang? It's your girl to the gram back with another video. It is time for another reaction video. We're about to react to things to do in your 20s to avoid regrets in your 30s, which I thought was very, very, very interesting since I just turned 25 and I still got five more years to go. So before we get to it, make sure you guys like, comment, share, subscribe. And without further ado, let's get straight into the video. Do these things in your 20s to avoid regret in your 30s. Your 20s are an exciting time full of experiences, merriment, and adventures. If you are enjoying your 20s, you should also ensure that you have the opportunity to do it in your 30s. Having fun is necessary to learn basic life skills and prepare for the future, so you do not regret it as you grow old. As you grow old, people assume you know how to handle tough situations and navigate life. However, that is not true. Therefore, you should start early preferably in the 20s, so you can have a sweet 30s. Here are eight things to do in your 20s to avoid regret in your 30s. One, take care of your physical health. In your 20s, you might think getting less sleep or eating burgers is cool, but your 30s will strongly disagree. On the contrary, the 20s are the time to take care of your health and inculcate healthy habits like getting enough sleep, having nutritious meals, working out every day, and staying hydrated. Two, build meaningful connections. You will meet various people during this time through school, your first job, professional seminars, or a friend's birthday party. Focus on building meaningful and long-term relationships with them. They can help you grow professionally and personally. However, do not shy away from cutting off negative and toxic people from your life who hold you back. Three, treat yourself but know when to stop. Saving money is important, and so is treating yourself. Mm -hmm. Wearing a nice pair of shoes or a blazer can create a positive impression in your social and professional life. Nevertheless, you must know when to stop. Do not splurge more than you earn and go broke. Additionally, do not spend it on things you will not need. Right. Five nice pairs of shoes are fine, but 20 seems too much. Four, start wealth accumulation. Finance influencers on social media are always talking about compounding, and it is some real deal. Getting rich by living from paycheck to paycheck is impossible, mm -hmm. especially as inflation rises. Right. Therefore, you should begin investing in your 20s. Although you may not have a lot of money, start with whatever you have and let compounding do its magic. Having a financial goal can give you a purpose for investing. Five, take a break from toxic positivity and hustle culture. Mm -hmm. The hustle culture on the internet is misleading. <laughs> While staying invested in your career is important, you do not have to work for 18 hours a day for 365 days. Mm -mm. Life is not meant for living in your old age. When everyone is bragging about their sleepless nights and achievements on social media, it is hard to stay unaffected. You may feel like you are not doing enough and falling behind in the race. However, the truth is you are not running out of time or you are not lazy for sometimes taking things slow. Six, learn the basic life skills. Cooking, cleaning, driving, changing a light bulb, and doing laundry are some basic life skills, and you should learn them in your 20s. Your parents may be doing all these for you now, but in the future, no one will. Right. Being able to take care of yourself is also a part of adulting, and while it will get boring at times, it makes you an independent individual. 7. Have a hobby and nurture it. Mm -hmm. Binge watching the latest season of web shows, taking a nap, or walking around the mall is fine, but you need real hobbies that keep you engaged. Hobbies like gardening, reading, painting, stitching, playing a sport, etc. help you meet new people, make you conversant, and enhance your personality. Mm -hmm. You can also take up hobbies that keep you mentally agile, such as crosswords and sudokus. 8. Focus on upskilling and reskilling. Mm -hmm. The job market is constantly evolving, and your skill set can become redundant any time. Mm -hmm. Therefore, focus on upskilling and reskilling and make it a habit. You have left school, but do not leave learning. Right. Having a curious mind also opens ways for new opportunities and experiences. The 20s are a thrilling phase in everyone's life. It is when you get your first job, take solo trips, start something new, fall in love, and make important life decisions. However, you should be mindful of your actions and choices because they will determine the course of your future and you surely don't regret them in your 30s. Thank you for watching the video. Please like, 
share, and let us know your thoughts in comments box. I don't know about y'all, but I had my first job at 16. <laughs> Not at my damn 20s, bitch. <laughs> but see, I was, I was always like that. Like, I wanted a job and make my own money since I was like 14, 15 years old. Like, I was never a person where I wanted things handed to me. I wanted to get it myself, and I'm still like that. So it's like, a lot of these things I have learned throughout my 20s. Even though I've only been 20, you know, for five years. Um, <laughs> but yeah, the, a lot of those things I have learned. And the biggest one I probably learned, well, the two biggest I probably learned in my 20s so far is letting go of toxic people, for sure. And also realizing that you don't have to work your entire life. You know, it's okay to, I wouldn't say splurge, but, you know, not be so, like, worried about finances. Not always, you know, making sure, like, you know, it's just, there's no point in stressing over things because that's just going to add unwanted stress to your life. And listen, not enough people talk about this, but stress does kill people. Okay, it do. It really do. Because it'll start affecting your health. And let's be honest, I wasn't. 100% with my health last year. So that's why I am on a new path this year. I'm making sure I'm taking care of my health no matter what. Because 2022 was not the best when it came to my health. Um, too many things was going on. But at the same time, it did take me to realize, like, life is so short. But at the same time, it's not worth stressing over things that I can't control. Or worrying about, you know anything because at the end of the day i'm gonna make it because <laughs> sometimes you just have to struggle to get to that place that you want to be in life and just grind and hustle but not always you know do it you need to take time for yourself like earlier i literally took like 20 minutes to myself 20 minutes that's all i gave myself but that's still more than enough than most people give themselves but that's it again so I definitely learned a lot of these things in this video. If you guys have or have it, let me know in the comments below. And if you're in your 30s, let me know if you agree with this video. Because if not, I might take some pointers from you. Who knows? But I will see you guys next video. Thank you for watching.